What's going on gamers? My name is Roll Easy and I'm back again tonight with a late video but we have another <laughs> solo duplication glitch. We actually brought one back from the dead. It's the old Zoom X off the radar glitch. Bruntango turned this into a duplication and it's actually back. Rockstar unpatched it I guess once they released the update today. Now, uh, thanks to uh, ZoomX for the off the radar, Bruntango for the dupe glitch, and Glitch Squad for actually letting us know uh, that it works again. All right, and I tried it, it took me a few times, but I finally got it to work. And before we get started, make sure to like the video, hit that blue thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and turn on post notifications for more of this fresh and informative dope content. Now, here are the requirements. You wanna be in an invite only session, an MOC with the personal vehicle storage in your bunker, a free elegy inside the MOC, you want a retro custom or a Benny's vehicle in one of your garages ready you know to dupe doesn't need a custom plate you don't need custom plates for this glitch it transfers plates over you need 10 piss washers in your inventory and you also for xbox users you need to be in a free aim session or just some session that you're in a different targeting mode from your friend because you're going to be joining somebody but then declining it you'll see if you guys don't know uh, already and ps4 you guys can use a recent activity for that part and uh, if you want to keep doing this over and over again, set your spawn location to your bunker so you can keep switching sessions and come right back to the uh, bunker. Now, what you see right here, if you want to, to spawn after the glitch, if you want to spawn back beside your bunker, you want to have your MOC outside and you want to bring it back into your bunker, okay? If you don't do this, you'll end up spawning at the docks every time. It's okay, but it's I do find it to be a little bit quicker to actually spawn over at your bunker every time, okay? So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so I've already pulled out my LG from my MOC. This was parked inside of my MOC originally, okay? Now, what we're going to do is we're actually going to break off the door from the free LG. Now, to do that, just get out of the car, hit Y again, and right away, you want to hit the uh, reverse. You see, just like that. So, just spam Y a couple times. When you get back in, you want to make sure that you don't hit it anymore once you're sitting down, and just reverse right away. You see that? Boom. I just reverse, and now I'm going to take the door off. So that's what you want. It will make the glitch a lot easier. Now, I was hearing people saying that they were having more luck actually, you know, going from uh, going from behind the blue circle. I didn't I didn't have any luck that way. So I parked it the same way I did it back when the glitch came out, you know, two or three weeks ago, whenever that was. And so what you're going to do is park it like this, get out, but you have to open up your interaction menu first or you're going to get sucked in the MOC. Now, as you see right here, these are a few failed attempts. You're gonna open up your interaction menu once you get out, close the interaction menu, and you wanna run towards this little area and press Y as you're going into the blue circle, okay? And you wanna do it at the same time. You're gonna see the animation of him actually going into the blue circle, and or into the blue circle and into the car door at the same time. All right, so a few more failed attempts. I do believe I hit it right here on this one. So I'm running. Hit Y, and then you saw that he was actually getting in right at that moment. So what I'm doing now, I'm opening up my dashboard and I'm hitting join game on one of my friends that I know is in a different targeting mode. Now I'm gonna get the first alert, I'm gonna accept it right here, deny the second alert. All right, and there you go, now you're glitched out. So once again, join your friend once you're glitched out right there, and you're gonna accept the first alert, and then you're gonna deny the second alert, which is the targeting mode. Now you're gonna wanna open up your inventory and go to beers. Now, as you can see right here, I couldn't drink my beers, and I forgot that I actually had a headpiece that wasn't allowing me to drink. So I had to go to gear, went to the left, went to the right, it took my gear off my head. Now I'm able to go drink. Now if you hear really closely, he's taking swigs right now. One, two, three, four, five. Now after that, he drops it. If you wanna know how I'm doing that, I'm actually pressing A, and then I'm tapping A again and holding it. So it's A, A hold, okay? Uh, for our PS4 users, it's X, X hold, okay? So you wanna hold on that second press and you'll be able to drink the entire beer. You'll start chugging them. Drink about eight of them and you're gonna pass out. And for PlayStation users, uh, instead of joining a friend like we did in a different targeting mode, you guys can use the recent activity. And I do believe you ex you you accept the uh, the recent activity and then you decline it. Uh, don't quote me on that. I'm not a PlayStation user. I am on Xbox. I can confirm this works on Xbox. Okay, and as you can see right here, I ended up invisible and over here by the hospital. I passed out drunk. So what you're going to want to do is make your way up the ladder, and there's usually a helicopter that spawns right up here. So you're just going to want to jump in one of the helicopters, or if there's only one, go ahead and jump in that one. And you're going to want to take this helicopter over to one of your garages. 
Okay, and if anybody's confused, just go rewatch the video. I, I had done this glitch many, many times before, so I got pretty used to it. And that was the setup of the car that I did, you know, a long time ago, or not a long time ago, but just a few weeks ago, you know, and it had always worked for me and it worked perfectly on this time. It took me about three or four tries once I positioned my car just like that. I would definitely recommend using it like that, especially if you're on Xbox, as I heard there were some Xbox users having trouble with this tonight. So these are my best recommendations for this glitch. It worked for me pretty, pretty quickly. Uh, I'm gonna be testing this all night as well, making sure that it still works and maybe other different methods that will get it to work easier. But this one worked pretty good for me, I'm not gonna lie. So now I'm making my way over here to Integrity Way. I do have a bunch of retros in here that I was using for the, for the, uh, the duplication glitch we were doing earlier and all of last week. And you're gonna simply run into your garage and you're gonna wanna pick any one of these, uh, any one of the retros or any car that you wanna dupe. I do recommend Elegy Retro Customs. They do sell for the most, but any Benny's vehicle will work. And remember, you don't have to have custom plates for this. This will change the plate. The RH8 plate will get reverted over to this one. So as you can see, I still go invisible right there. You start off not invisible in the garage, but you do go invisible eventually. So check it out. I have the virus plate right over here on this car. So you see that custom plate, virus. Now, I'm going to tap right trigger to drive out, R2 for PlayStation, and right when you get out of the garage, don't do anything else, just open up your interaction menu and you're going to want to go to Mobile Operations Center and request MOC. Now, once you request the MOC, it's going to spawn you at the docks if you didn't do what I did in the beginning of the, of the video, but if you did do what I did, you're going to spawn right here in front of the bunker or around there. Open up your interaction menu right away and you see that, 49YDF839. That plate transferred over from the RH8. So now you're just going to want to request the MOC once again. And once you do that, the MOC should spawn somewhere near you. Now, once it spawns near you, you're just going to want to simply drive to it. The dupe glitch is basically done. That's it. We just have to save the car. So as I make my way over here, just cleared that fence. And it's crazy. I can't believe we're actually doing this dupe glitch again. I really can't believe it still works now. Even after, you know, the patch, I guess it got unpatched, you know, with this big update. Check that out. You get the crazy cutscene that you're in the bunker. That still works. This brings me back, man. I had a lot of fun with this glitch. I got really good at it for a while. And it seems to be back. And that's pretty much it, guys. That's the car saved just like that. You can drive it in once. I drive it in twice most of the time just to make sure it saves. But that's the majority of the glitch. There's really not much else to it. Like I said, if you want to, oh yeah, and if you want to keep doing this over and over again, what you can do is actually, you put this back in your uh, MOC, come outside, and you call for another uh, for another RH8. And when you call for another RH8 from your garage, just go up to the MOC, press the right D-pad, it's going to ask you to transfer cars. So go ahead and just transfer, you know, this retro back over to whatever garage the RH8 came from, and now your new RH8 will be in here, and pull this back into your bunker, and you're ready to go. And that's it, you can keep rinsing and repeating over and over and over again. And that's the glitch, very, very, you know, simple. Once you get glitched out, that does take a little while. Don't be discouraged if you don't hit it. It might take you a few tries. You have to be a certain distance away from the blue circle or else the blue circle will disappear. All right, they, with the patch, they made it so that if you're too close to it, the blue circle disappears. So you have to be the right distance away. Okay, and uh, yeah, so that's gonna be it for me, guys. My name is Roll Easy. I hope you enjoyed the video like press that blue thumbs up comment subscribe if you're new and turn on post notifications if you want to be informed and entertained and know the instant i come out with any more fresh and informative dope gta 5 online content my name is roll easy and i'm out of here guys have a good night <laughs>